So for the past couple of weeks we've been installing point motors and these are Hornby point motors with a capacitor discharge unit, a CDU, to give them an extra kick. This is the point motor represented here and a three-way switch as a neutral central position and then left and right for the point so the point can operate left and right. It needs a 16 volt AC input in off of the controller or for example 25 volt DC maximum input and that just goes into that side of the CDU quite simple and then coming out of the CDU you have a black wire in this case going to the central point of the point motor and then the red wire going from the CDU out to the central neutral position of the toggle switch. And then the other two sides of the switch, they go to either side of the point motor. So it's relatively straightforward to do electrically. Doing it under a layout gets a little bit more confusing. The other thing I've found is I've got two point motors and two points operating off of the same CDU and in order for one to operate the other one must be in the neutral position otherwise it's taking all of the power it seems from the CDU. So you must have one in neutral position for the other one to operate. That is the CDU that I am using. This is the point motor, three wires into the electrics. It physically connects onto the point arm and then I've glued it down but you can use track pins to tack it in. And that's represented by the green, red and black wires here on the diagram. These are my two toggle switches, one for the curve point and one for the tunnel point and they simply operate like that. And you must give it a moment for the capacitor to build up its charge so it can discharge it. So there you go, I've shown you the wiring diagram, I'm not going to show you the boring part of me soldering it up and connecting all the wires, that's just using chocolate block connectors and stuff like that, but the point motors and the switches, everything functions, I just need to put the CDU in position so there's some double sided tape or velcro or something like that for that. Do need to be able to get access to things and swap them over if necessary. But yeah, it all works. So really pleased with that.